today I'm doing a video that was requested a lot. I start my videos saying that every single time. <laughs> I know, I'm sorry. But this really was requested a great deal. It's a um, body shape video, so how to dress if you are a boyish shape. Now a boyish shape is basically where you have little or no curves, so you've got a small bust, small hips, and typically you're pretty lean, like you don't put on a lot of weight or you have trouble putting on weight so basically you're lucky and I think that a lot of people tend to say oh you know if you're boy shape or if you're really skinny uh, you can wear whatever you want and to a certain extent that is true you can definitely get away with a lot more because your body type is that of a catwalk model so the reason why they use super skinny girls on catwalks and on runways is because clothes generally hang better on them. So having said that, there are certain things that you shouldn't do and also certain things that will make you look even better. So, um, okay, so let's start with accessories. So since you're small and you have a smaller bust, you want to kind of pad it out a little bit more. So you could take something like this. This is just a chunky necklace. You can wrap it around, like double it over if you want to. You can also do the same thing with earrings, you know, big statement earrings like these. Um, I love these. They just add interest and they kind of pad out your frame and your upper body. And then you could also do the same thing with a scarf you know, a colorful scarf, a big scarf, um, that's going to pad you out also. And in terms of belt, what you really don't want to do is pick a belt that's super thick, like this one. This here <laughs> is not good for boyish shape. A thick belt like this is going to chop your body in half, and because you have a pretty uh, thin figure anyway, it's just going to make you look even thinner and um, lankier and that's not good. So instead, you could pick a belt that looks like this. So it's a skinny belt and something like this is going to make you look a lot more voluptuous and just add volume to your frame. I guarantee, pair this with anything. If you're wearing just like a straight dress or just a pretty plain shirt, this is going to work wonders. It's going to give you a lot more curves. So, yeah. Okay, so that was accessories. Um, in terms of jeans, wear whatever style you feel like. The one thing I will say is that low-rise jeans will suit you down to the ground because you don't have uh, big hips and, or you don't have much hip at all. <laughs> so, um, low-rise jeans, you want to show off your tight tummy and your skinny hips and just show it all off. So definitely go for low-rise jeans. but. Any style of jean is going to fit you just fine. Tops, shirts, uh, that kind of thing. Um, you want to go for a high neck, much like what I'm wearing today. And I know I'm breaking the rules because I'm an hourglass shape, I'm not a boyish shape. But I'm little, I'm pretty small, so it's okay, it works. I can get away with it so long as I'm careful. So yeah, anything like this with a high neck, it's going to give you a bit more padding and it's going to make your bust look bigger. Another style of shirt that looks really cute on the boyish shape is this. Um, this is a pussy bow shirt and um, basically that just means a shirt with a high neck and a big bow at the neck. And this looks so good on girls with small busts because it just gives you padding and gives you gives the illusion of a bigger bust. Also another great tip for boy shapes is to go for good boy, good boy, pee in your crate. <laughs> We're trying to train him to pee in his little crate. Um, yeah, good boy. <laughs> he wants a treat now because that's what happens, he gets a treat. Anyways, um, do you want to say hello? Do you want to say hello? Come here. One second. Come here. Say hi, YouTube. Say hi. He just peed in his crate. Who's a good boy? Who's a good boy for peeing in your crate? Yes. You are so good. Say hi, YouTube. 
He was pretty exploited yesterday. <laughs> okay. Go back. I have to talk about fashion. Um, so... We live across, kind of across from the airport. I'm not going to say which one because, you know, I don't want to tell people where I live. But um, we live across the way from an airport. So that's why you hear a lot of planes and helicopters and stuff like that. Um, so sorry for all the distractions, but let's get on with things. So as I was saying, um, a good tip for girls that have boyish shapes is to go for things with ruffles particularly you know shirts like this with like ruffle sleeves or ruffles on top to stop it um this is going to just add volume to your frame and a good example of a skirt that kind of fits that style is this pencil skirt that i've shown you in my haul stop it no you can see it has these big ruffles at either side, so kind of like a tulip skirt. A tulip skirt is just one that goes like that, um, shaped like an upside down tulip. These look really good on you um, because they add like volume. At the same time, you don't want to look like you're drowning in fabric, but something very neat like this with just some pleats and ruffles at the sides will be perfect for you because it gives the illusion that you have fuller hips. In terms of dresses, this style looks amazing on a boy shape um, because of the ruffles here and also because this is a flapper style so like a flapper dress um, if you don't know what that is it's basically this it's got either lots of ruffles or like strings hanging off and like layers of it these because of their straight shape are great on boyish shapes to somebody with curves this would not look good on but otherwise for boyish shapes it definitely works and it just adds volume I feel like I keep repeating myself and saying adding volume but that's basically what you're trying to achieve okay so I hope this video is helpful for you guys and if you have any questions just leave me a comment below and I'll try and get back to you bye